What's up guys, I am Warmaster Moloch and this is, I believe, part 20 of my legendary difficulty Quick Head Taker. This is Total War Paint the Map campaign in which I'll be trying to take over the entire map as your boy here, Quick. So, we've got a big fight to start this particular video out with. Two full stacks plus a garrison. Only one full-size dinosaur though so I'm feeling pretty confident we can get through with this we've got lots of magic we've got lots of artillery and we've got lots of guns so let's put these uh, so we can actually reject the reinforcements actually ah but do I want to do that I mean I had to we've actually got two dinosaurs there forgot about the ancient stegodon do I want to do that though I feel like that's short change in you let's go for the whole lot fuck it it'll be fun I swear Right, going for all in on this when I could have lightning struck is probably stupid, but hey, this is the entertainment business after all, and I'm sure you guys would rather watch a big stupid seed that siege that makes me suffer. Because deep down, everyone watching on YouTube is a bit of a sadist who wants to watch the content creators suffer. So. I'm going to do that for you because I'm just that kind of public spirited guy. Let's put all of these guys up here. It's going to be a challenge. Let's go. Okay, towers are done. You can stop firing at will now, because I'm going to try and take that hero off the walls with Je off the wall with Jezails. But he's moving around. Oh, hello, hello. That's an interesting tactic, lads. Let's get the rattling guns forward, just in case they do something as stupid as that again. Get him. Yeah, he's going down nice and fast. We want to keep the Jezails. Um, fully stocked up with ammo if we can because we've got a general another wizard we'll get that one while it's up on the walls actually and a couple of dinosaurs to deal with just making sure everything's recording okay oh do you know what just stop Get back. You're moving forward like idiots. We'll let one unit deal with this guy. It's not going to take long. He'll go down fast. It's just that I want him to die rather than routing. There we go. He did actually stick around long enough to die. So they go to there. No, it's not going to do that there. Let's try these. No. You just love the siege glitches, lads. I see a dino. Okay, Jesus Christ. Yeah, it's just not going to fire at anything. Okay, fine. We'll smash holes in the walls instead then. Oh, that did a fair bit of damage there. Took out some units there. And again, and let's get the gate as well. So we've got three angles of attack. Okay, and we'll go for this unit now. Jezel's to here because I think you can shoot something through there for me. Taking out the walls early means that we can use magic a bit more. Saurus Spears, where's our chonky boy? There he is. You can stop. Taking that out's a good effect on balance of power for us. Yeah, we got him. We got him. He's gone. 
Don't move you little turret, stay there where we can shoot you. There we go, we're getting the general now. Nice that they're all blobbing up on the ground there, so one of our plague priests is going to have a fine time in there. We'll choose this one. He's the one who gets to go and have fun today. It is usually the leftmost one, to be fair, that I go with. There we go, that's gone. Awesome, okay, we're off to a good start. Ooh, hello. Stupid skinks. because that is actually the perfect place to drop one now. Can't just blow up like that for a little bit longer and we're golden. Plenty of arcane conduits here because all three play priests have them. Yes, move in there. Blob up, guys. That's great. Yeah, I didn't do great there. Sauruses are pretty durable, though, so it's kind of understandable. Let's try and take those off the walls. Not going to do much against Croxigors with this. of stuff still at the back as well. We're going to have to use all of our gunpowder here, I reckon. Well, our warp stone, you know what I mean. Yeah. It is frustrating when they move out of the way. Plague is such a good spell, but it doesn't move. Which is its strength and its weakness. Because enemies can move away from it, but at least you can predict where it is and where it's going to go. Almost 400 kills for him, but we burnt through a fair bit of magic there. We still got loads, so there's nothing to worry about. Can we hit those with the artillery? I think we can. So I'll do as much damage as we can. We've still got the poison wind mortars as well, so we're doing a lot of good early damage here. Lots of dead bodies lying around. Okay. Um, hmm. Do you know what? I'm going to shoot a hole in these walls here so that we just get the angle for some extra killing in this particular region. I, oh, do I want to use the Jezels there? I mean, they are Croxigors, so monstrous infantry and that they're a little bit more durable and plague doesn't hurt them basically Those are gone. Let's get these. Gotta save some for that salamander. Done good work so far. We still got a fair bit of ammo. Let's get this over to here because he can boost that. What is he 
it gives accuracy and reload skill, yeah. Not bad. Okay, let's go for artillery on there. They're skinks, so they shouldn't last long. Here, that's okay. We'll just plague them and they will go away. Oh wow, they didn't entirely go away. Well that sucks. This looks like a good excuse me, a good spot for the next one. Was okay. Oh, that looks like a good spot for here as well. Nice blob. Yep, okay. Shooting down. of stuff to kill. Lots and lots of stuff to kill. There's the ancient salamander, so we want to get that to come around at some point. Our magic is getting used up. get more units to come forward I'm going to try and clear these spots here because once units start to die off here they're more likely to send more units forward to fill in the gaps and that will increase the effectiveness of our magic because we'll be hitting more blobs hopefully they'll send forward that ancient salamander a downside is we don't have a warlock engineer on a doom flayer here so it's harder to lure the enemies towards the holes shitty little skinks that are just out of range. Why don't I just have one unit fire at them? Oh, for fuck's sake, someone else is fired. There's more skinks. Okay. That's a waste of magic. Aim a volley at them. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Jezzo, shoot them. Can you actually just shoot rather than walking for crying out loud? Those skinks are very durable for some reason. Presumably it's the... Uh, 
buff to their leadership from being inside a settlement. doing okay for kills. Okay, he's do he's got 700 odd kills, so yeah, 723. He's doing better than okay. okay I'm going to have him hit that there next, and we're going to get them to stop firing. now 813 cool really want to get the salamander hunting packs and the salamanders forward in fact it might even make sense to go for them with the mortars because they can do mortar type damage themselves so Let's see what our rate. Okay, so we're about here, so let's move to there. We'll put the rattling guns there. Oh, shit. Okay. Uh, Jezel's deal with them. Didn't have the rattling guns perfectly positioned for dealing with this stuff. Come on, guys. You can kill them faster than that for crying out loud. Just need to check something. Okay. That Plague Priest is not feeling especially good right now, but he's okay. Right, let's attack the Salamander Hunting Pack, see if we can get rid of them. Because they're probably the biggest threat that's left. Another threat is running out of ammo. They're routing. Let's bring these round to here. Is that a hero? Or that's a... Yeah, that's... Well, it's something. Okay, so that's a hero on a dinosaur. So let's bring that to there. Those to there. And let's start shooting it. There we go. Good and fast. Love the rattling gun action. Okay, so... Oh, it's a lord. Okay, whatever. Either way, the important thing is someone got whacked. And we needed that. Okay, they're not necessarily using their ammo to the best of their ability here. They're hitting a lot of the buildings. The Awakening is a place with a lot of shitty buildings in the place. One more volley there, I think, should get rid of them. Okay, go for that. No, 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 you come back. Uh, let's go for them. Mortars are out of ammo. So I'm going to bring these rattling guns to here. Uh, actually, do you know what? Two firing teams. Two and three. Go back to there. You shoot in there. Here we go, here come the salamanders. We can just get rid of them so they stop bloody firing at us. Kill it, kill it, kill it. Anytime you like, just start bloody shooting. One more left. For crying out loud. Okay. I'm not sure where to use that right now. Okay, 
it would come within range, it'd, we'd kill it, but it's not doing so. What's this here? Hold on, Spear Riders, okay. Eight hundred and eighty. He's doing his job. It's just a matter of whether it's going to be enough in the grand scheme of things. We got stuff in there. Okay, so we'll have one unit fire at that because they should rip those temple guards to bits. Yeah. How about over here? Yep, yeah, we got some units there, so we'll. Or a unit there, so let's get a unit of rattling guns over to attack that. to there. Let's see if we can get Quake to, t Quake to tease some out. Can they hit? Yep. We're all about just aiming for the army loss penalty here. Uh, that'd be a waste. So the problem is, because they shit up on top of the walls there, I can't go fire at will because they'll fire at crap that we don't want to fire at. Yeah, they'll fire at all this shit up here and it's not going to do anything. Round it here. Yeah, our recharge rate is now really slow, but we do have three arcane conduits, so we can speed it up. Let's use the magic there. Oh, they the little shits. He got hit, so he stopped for stopped. Jesus Christ, piss off, Salamander, you little prick. That wasted one of the arcane conduits there. Not that, you know, they get counted or anything, but still. Come to here. And shoot that stupid, shitty salamander. Oh, eat shit. really hard to see what's actually alive and what isn't here. It's just a big blob of dead things. Stupid lizards.
going. There we go, there you come. Yeah, dropping plagues up here, not really that effective, but nor is there either. So I want to try and lure some things towards the front. Because basically we're running out of blobs. But I can't fire at will because of the stupid wall glitches. We really want that salamander to come forward, the um, the big one, the ancient salamander, because we want to trigger the army loss penalty, and that holds a lot of their balance of power. Oh shit, quick, get out of the way, mate. Where the hell are 15 of these? Oh, here we go. Couldn't see them past the uh, the dinosaur body. Jeez, they do not give up, do they? Okay, so that's dealt with. What are they going to plug that gap with? Let's bring Queek over to find out. There we go. These guys will slot in there. Oh, apparently not. Okay, how many of them are there? 47. I'll play. Them. Okay, so they've gone up onto there. That's a wee bit irksome, but it does mean plague's viable again up there. Yep, they're going up there too. Okay, so we'll use plague up here. Or maybe we'll just shoot these instead. dealt with. Cool. We've burned through so much magic there. We're really going to be cutting this fine. I'm not sure we've got enough to win this. Oh, no, 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 no. That's the Plague Priest. Send Queek in. I just wish I could use bloody fire at will so I wouldn't have to micro this unit over and over again. There. Okay, the spear rod is going to come over. Just the temple guides, that's okay. Oh, they're going up there for fuck's sake. They're just not paying very much attention to Queek. Oh, hello. Can we get that? There we go. Let's get those as well while we're at it. Let's cut off some of their speed. Oh, for fuck's sake. Fucking skinks. Coming towards Queek. A 
looks like they are. So let's move him out. Awesome. Oh, they're going for the fucking walls, aren't they? Ugh, okay. This is a long one, lads. There we go. kills does he have? So 1,171 and we've still got all of this to go as well because they are just soaking up ammo. Soaking it up. And where is that salamander? Okay, so they've still got some skinks over there. They've still got some salamanders there. Do we have a clear shot? Right, we might be able to use a couple of units of Jezels to finish off those salamanders. Probably not even a couple of units actually. Let's leave those there and just let this one unit snipe at them. Horned ones, okay. Let me bring that unit to there. And we'll shoot those. All about that army loss penalty here, because killing all of them, we're probably not going to be able to do. Shooting enough that they give up, that we can do. Can I... No, that won't work. Come on. They get themselves into a good firing position, and then they start rearranging themselves, like, like their balls are hanging on the wrong side of their trousers or something. I don't think Skaven even wear trousers, like what the fuck. Okay, they're gone. So let's see if we can move this unit to here and do the same sort of angled shot to them. Yep. They're gone. And is that the army loss penalty? It, I think it is for one of the armies. Oh no, no, everyone went. Fantastic. Okay, that saved us so much bloody work. Heroic victory. Okay, that was good. I was expecting that to be really tight at the end, but no. Okay, a testament to just being patient and burning your way through an enemy. That's worth a lot of money. And we've got just enough movement range to tier 5 this place straight away. Excellent. So there's another lizard stack over there, but we are cutting off now their capability to just spam us with armies and all that other shit that's been causing us trouble. Go with that. Go with that. Go with that. And we're also setting up our own recruitment capabilities in Lustria that we can use to take them out. I'm not going to spend money at the blood swamps. Master Engineer. I still, I'm so curious to know: Are there Skaven here, or is it? Because if there's Skaven there, it's, well, it can't be. Surely they wouldn't have left Skaven alive. It can't be. Corruption. Can it? Can it? Hmm questions. Uh, Queek is here. So I'm going to send this guy round to, I'm thinking Itza, which is about here, um, and Earthquake it. Let's have a look at our armies. There's another full stack up there. We'll deal with that. Ah, uh, yeah, he's the guy who is due to retake the Oak of Ages for us. And then we'll just get rid of him. Food. Okay. Right, another 
quick look at the armies. Master engineer. Okay, I don't think there's anything else we need to do this turn. Let's end the turn and see what happens. If I'm wrong, I'm wrong. Sorry, accidentally paused while trying to eat something. Okay, so they're attacking Port Achaba before I could do anything about it. They've got a couple of dinos. This place is only tier 3 wall, so I'm not sure we're going to be able to hold this. Yeah, I don't think we can hold this. It's a tier 5 settlement, but it's only got tier 3 walls. And they've got flyers. We're not going to be able to do anything about this. Not against the fucking Dread Saurian. And an ancient salamander, because we can hold this gate open. Which is fine, but the salamander can blast us out of it. Like, we'll try and do what we can, but I just don't think it's possible. If we had tier 5 or tier 4 walls, maybe. Even though this garrison's shit. But I just don't see it working here. Going up! Okay, so we're going to sh shoot at the Dreadsaurian first. That can go for... is that a Salamander? That's the Salamander, okay. In a way, we should actually seriously consider going for the Salamander first. Obviously they're shooting at the towers, which is completely bloody worthless. Go for the Salamander hunting pack. And you. The more damage we can do the, to the dinosaurs, the better. So that ancient salamander is going down hard. The hero or general here is on a a stegodon. That is unfortunate. Very far on this. I'm not sure that's a. Ah, uh, why not? Might as well. Because once the thing is, if these dinosaurs get him, there is nothing we can do. They will just go straight through us. Is he still holding that door open? He is. Hopefully that glitch is still working, because otherwise we have big problems. And that salamander is going to knock him out the door. Right. Can we shoot the salamander? I don't think we can. We don't have enough range here for the slingers either, I don't think. Let's try. Because if they hit him, they'll knock him out. Right. These guys can attack this general then instead. Ah, uh, the flyers are coming in. They'll attack the stuff that's on the gate first normally. That we're fucked. The gate is now shut. We are fucked. Um, let's get these out the way. God damn it. Yeah, we're fucked here. We weren't able to do enough. Get those round there. 
Uh, let's have him warp lightning then. It's a tier 5 settlement, so we've got a war uh, tier 3 wall, so we've only got one warp bomb with the new um, with the new nerfs the Skaven have received. Which, to be fair, were kind of necessary. But they made warp bomb a lot less useful anyway. You know, they stopped being as useful. The warp bombs stopped being as useful in the last one. You have to, like, hit your own units just to weaken them enough. Yeah, those flyers took out a unit really quickly. The dinosaurs, the uh, Pexuatl, the Lizardmen, must have some kind of settlement on Ulthwan for them to be constantly just shitting out armies around here. Try and take those Ripperdactyls out. You, please go for that. How are we getting on here? Okay, we're. Yeah, that's okay. Okay, we got the Ripperdactyls, which means these can now. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake, they came back. Just fuck off, Ripperdactyls. No, do not start firing that shit there. Do not fire that shit there. For fuck's sake. Right, how are these getting on? Okay, these are going down. Where are these? Okay, these need to come back because we're going to need them against this fucking Dreadsaurian. Right, shoot at that. You shoot at that. You shoot at that. Just everyone shoot at that fucking thing. Okay, that will now poison our own troops if I use it there, so it needs to come around here. All storm vermin, hit the fucking dread saurian. You. Okay, you, menace below there. Aim for that. Um, I'm not even sure if we're going to be able to... Okay, we might get a decent warp bomb here. I haven't used one of these since the nerf, so let's see how much damage it does. I'm willing to bet they fucked it up completely. It's okay, but it's not as good as it used to be, put it that way. Okay, the Dreadsaurian is gone. Right, the 
come back. come to there. We want them to fall back to here so that they've got a clear firing line. You guys all come to here. I'm not sure they can even get back far enough. We're just going to have to abandon those gutter runners there. We're not going to win. I just want to hurt these fucking lizards as much as I can. With their spammy dinosaur shit. Now, turn around and get them. which is understandable because we're not doing great here. You come round here. I would like to get the general if we can, but I don't think we've got enough time. Yeah, that's it. Army losses. Didn't rate our chances there against that many monsters, and the, the big problem was the flyers knocked us out of the doorway, so we couldn't hold it. We'll... We'll actually take it back straight. Oh, they fucking raised it. Okay, whatever. We won't struggle to, like, hold that territory. And we'll get that army. We'll get our revenge there. Like, straight away. It's just a shame that we spent all that food building that place up. Warlock, master of Scryer! Kill fight mode on! This meat flesh will do nicely. We've got Alistar here with what is basically by high off standards a shit stack, so we're not worried about them. Trust him for now now. Untrusted worm. Poison after. Unless the map is really triadled, we will trash Alistar there. Or if they bring in like a ton of reinforcements. I cannot obey. But I don't think that's gonna happen. Yeah, we've got control there. How close can we get? I'm gonna let her take Alisaley. I was saying that, how good's the garrison at Alisaili? It's shit. What's her army like? She's, she has the Sword of Cain as a thing. Master Engineer! Hmm. I don't know if she's going to sit inside it or if she's going to try and um, raise it. If she. Nah, yeah, we'll go inside, screw it. If she raised it that would actually suit us because she'd be left somewhere where we could get her. Mastery. I really want to know where these pissing beast men are. There they are. Okay, so we're just going to head towards that and we're going to go and get them. They, I mean, they are recruiting, so their army's getting a little bit better, but they're not really strong enough to challenge us. Build up the 
black pit. Warlock, master of scrap. Ugh, that was brutal. So this one, is this close enough to get Dargoth? I think so. Yeah, he can get Dargoth. He'll fight them all on! Good for nothing, pilferous! Just take that. And this army can underway jump towards Black Pillar. Warlock Master of Scryer. This one can get us on our way through the north, so we can take all of the Chaos Waste settlements up there. And we're just going to sort of one to our way through all of Nagaroth there. Ah, we've got a new province under control, so let's give that the food. Commandment. He's going to go for Blacklight Tower, of course. broken lands now as well so we can get another commandment down for more food Power to, to weapons. Hexawartel has Hotex column that's fine we'll get through that just wondering where they're sending our maybe the armies are coming like from there through here and then through Ulf 1 I don't know could be either way Master of Scryer. He can go to there. Can I reach the Blood Swamps? I can't. But I haven't spent anything there really, have I? Whilst my my doom racket. It's there. Okay, we found some more lizards. Let's get rid of them. Those are the survivors from the previous siege, I think. If I go to there, Run, we'll try and catch these out as they come to attack us. It's just refreshing to not have vampire attrition when we arrive here. Fuming Serpent will be fine. Let's go for Grayling Moon, actually. All of these places are now basically fine, so we'll get food there. I hate trying to figure out my way around Norsken lands because their settlements are so stupidly positioned. It really makes them annoying to keep track of. Definitely go food there. Bay of Blades. Conclave. Time to do it, leader. Yeah, that's already food. Food. Yep, yeah, that's all good. Winter Pyre, yep. Yeah. All good. Okay. 
settlement that needs to be upgraded is Marienburg. Get that. Yeah, they're fine. Master in kinda. Taking a lot of attrition. How long until this is ready? Two turns. Master of we have all the heroes we want. Yep, okay. Four heroes and a general, that's good. Let's check our armies, make sure everyone's moved. Now, the thing is, we should now be okay over here. I don't think we're going to need to raise another army to defend here. Let's get rid of that and put another public order building in just to keep control of it. Okay, let's see what needs to be built up. Blood swamps, we're not going to build that up. Skill points. To betray. <laughs> Always fun. Tenacity. Stinks like a grazier. Should kill when get get a chance. Uh, we'll go warpstone tokens there, actually. Get the actual winds of magic. That's it for the turn. Okay. Let's see how the next one goes. Alistar the shitlord has just um, caught me while I'm eating. We will fight this, obviously. Let's have a look at the map. Actually, yeah, take a look at the map first. We shouldn't have any trouble beating that. Oh, that map is hideous. But I don't want to be in a position in which we can't retreat again. And there are positions we can fight in there, so let's fight him. Okay, so the reinforcements are coming from over there, but to be fair, they're absolute trash, so I'm not worried about them in the first place. This looks like the spot to go for. It's just, look at how lumpy this is. For firing teams, weapons teams like we've got, this is not great. And moving back doesn't really make it much better. Get those there. We've got trees over this side. Well, this is not a good map for us. But we're just going to have to deal with it. We can, if we need to, retreat. I'm wondering if I should just eschew the height. But then the trees are here. You know, you've got the draw distance to factor in. Um, go for that. because we want the rattling guns I mean look at how shit that is that is not great it might even make sense to start here and pull back this looks like a terrible spot to start off in but if you look at where you can fall back to oh Jesus Christ right, just get to there and then just get to there okay we could conceivably pull back to there. We still wouldn't get the full benefit of our range, but we'd get something approaching a flat line. Or well, for that matter, even there might be better. We're not going to get the full benefit of our range. I think we have to like accept that for this map. 
Yeah, look at this. There's just fucking trees everywhere. I hate Ulthworm. So we want him to go there. I don't know. Should I just bite the bullet and go here? Maybe... Look, I tend to be really focused on getting the, exactly the same shape out for my armies, but maybe I should just bite the bullet and go like that. Oh, look at that. That's crap. And this is just eating all of our range. I might have to just, like, deal with the fact that this map's terrible. I can retreat from here and I could move backwards to make that a more viable option but I'm not sure that would be to our benefit because we don't know how bad the map's going to be when we do fight it. Fortunately this isn't a real killer stack but it's not a terrible stack that he's brought either so we need to... Okay so they're over here which favours the position that I chose. Okay, they've both got a sort of stone. Master! We can get Alistar to come in. That'll be good. Yes, yes. That one's so good. Over here, here. Oh, fuck's sake. Right, I'm going to drop a menace below on that as soon as I can. We need to get our match. He's the only one that's got an arcane conjurer as well. Shit. Go that way. Get rid of those sisters of Avalon. I need to dump a menace below on top of that. don't have much to protect our flanks. I'm going to need to move the plague priests around it just to delay them. The phoenixes are going out wide because they always bloody do. Like that did nothing to those eagle claws. Right, we need to start summoning just to delay them. General, get over there. We need you to... No, 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 no. Yeah, we've got problems here. This is a really bad situation. Everything about this map absolutely fucking hates us. No! Do not fire that shit into our own troops. Right, you guys. Kill Alistar. I want him dead. We need him dead as soon as possible. eagle as well. Shit. Yeah, they're right into the back of us here. Yeah, everyone's getting taken out. I just need to get them out. You guys, get off your artillery pieces and them route. Yeah. I should have backed out as soon as I saw the state of this map because this is not good for us. this guy's going to get whacked because this phoenix just would not go down. Absolutely brutal. Like, if we could have caught that army in any kind of ambush whatsoever, we roast it. Alistar didn't even come close to dying and we had all four units of Jezel shooting at him. Their artillery pieces did not go down when I menaced below them. Right, 
These are her. Get out. Get out! Like I told you to leave. And you. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on. Can I get a plague on there? No. I was hoping to get like just one thing out of it. No, that was disastrous. That was really, really bad. That is as bad a map as you can find with that still has open space for an uh, weapons team army. Like this stack here is not good. But we couldn't defend our flanks against the Arcane Phoenix. We couldn't. Uh, we we had a bit of a fuck up when we were trying to defend against the cavalry because we were having to do so much to keep the phoenix out that the cavalry were able to sneak around the other side and we weren't able to control the rest of the space and fucking Alistar does he ha hang on does he have the sword of cane no Alariel's got the sword of cane so we lost one unit of artillery we just have to deal with that they're going to follow up fight us I just have to hope the map's better Yeah, he was obviously going to follow up fight us. Let's have a look at the state of this map. I mean, that might be better, it might not. I honestly can't say. It's better than the other one on first glance. Because that other one was awful. Oh, mate, this is not good either. <laughs> Jesus, look at this. It's not even so much the trees, it's the gigantic hills that we're fighting on. I'm just going to do as much damage to them as I can and see how it goes, but it's a combination of absolutely massive hills and trees around the hills too. It's as bad as it gets. It really is. This is like Wood Elf level bad territory for us. And Wood Elves are horrifying for... Um, Wood Elf settlements are horrifying for Skaven. So yeah, I think we're going to lose the army here. So I'm going to go like that. He is so weak that I can't really do anything with him because their archers will kill him straight away. I just need to hope that they come in hard and fast and I've got to hug the line. don't think they've got very good firing lines here, but we just have to deal with what the situation as it stands. Right, get that to there, all the way back. Jezails there, so they're not in the trees. That there, that there. And then the rattling guns come to here, just because that's... They've still got that hill to deal with. I feel like maybe these units should come deeper while these three actors. Oh, for fuck's sake. Get the general out of the way because those bloody artillery pieces have gone straight for him. They're in such bad shape. Right, let's start the summons. Because we need a distraction. You hit your arcane conduit. I really want these flyers to come forward as soon as possible. We desperately need his... Kill that fucking thing. But don't fire that at it, for fuck's sake. Oh my, look at how little damage it's taking at the moment. to offend it by doing that. Ah, oh, there we go. They got it. They've got it. They've got it. And it fucking revived. God damn it. He's about to get the plague priest. Come 
master! Okay, now you can fire at, well, not fire at will, but go for there. Oh my god, oh, Jesus, they need to turn around and kill him. Just let him through. And we've only got one play for his life, god damn it, okay. Right. Aim that into there. Excellent. Okay. We killed him. Go, 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 go. Uh, actually, fall back. Hit that. Hit that. And hit that. Ah, oh, fuck. Play Priest went. Okay. We no longer have anyone for tanking. Well, we've got him, but he's about to die, so... Oh, they just decided to stand there. Okay, cool. Good work, lads. Well done. Really appreciating your efforts. General is going to get wrecked. We just have to deal with it. Ah, fucking bastards. Okay, get rid of them. Fucking dragon princes. These need to come back because they will do a huge amount of damage if they get the chance. Kill them. We need the avalanche mortars on this. Right, you. Oh my god. Right, you get back. They're just not killing the Dragon Princes fast enough. Shoot them. We are literally begging for army losses right now. Avalanche Mortars into that. Turn around and shoot. Come on, the Avalanche Mortars. They might just have enough power to do it for us. Get them. Just didn't quite have enough muscle. Not quite enough muscle to compensate for how bad that map was for us. See, the army did... The amount of effort it takes for weapons teams to kill a phoenix can absolutely destroy um, your ability to deal with the rest of an army. So if you're playing as high elves and you're going up against Skaven, get phoenixes. Okay, let's have a look at this map. 
she's on a fucking she's gonna be on an eagle oh my god if I'd have any idea that it might stick me with this map there's no way I'd have uh, gone inside that settlement I wanted to have some extra reinforcements in case she brought in an extra army because then I could deny large this armies so this is probably a mistake here this we're on Ulf 1 and we get this map okay Yeah, this is an absolutely dire situation for us. Really, really, really bad. I know I say it a lot, but I mean, this is bad. Because the only place to make this kind of army work is through here. And they have got flyers that can just come over the top of this. And, you know, they've got phoenixes. Those are hard for us to kill. They are much, much more difficult than the dragon. The dragon does not worry me in the slightest. I mean, that can come over the top here, but we can shoot that down like it's nothing on its way in. It's all the rest of this stuff. So what I have to do is try and lure some of their troops away to give us more time. And I mean the flying troops. I don't give a shit about the rest. We'll wipe the floor with that. I have to deal with the flyers. Right. Those need to go and bother that bloody phoenix. These need to just get in position. So, play claw catapults there. That there. I don't need all three plague priests there, so... That. That. Oh, no, 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 no. Actually, the Jezels have to stay there for a sec, don't they? Because I need the opportunity to actually kill Alaril. I'm going to take that to there. This is going to be so bloody hard. There's the artillery. Right, let's try and distract them a little bit by hitting their artillery. Quick, quick, go. Quick, I need to hit that just to slow them down. Because the problem is the Jezels are not really going to be much help here. And oh my god, the Mortars don't have enough range either. Do you know what? Fuck it. Jezels to here. We're just going to have to deal with this as is. We managed to divide stuff up, but it's mostly the bloody infantry. And the infantry is not the problem. So I need the general to go over here and just sort of lure them over. The war lines will go down in no time. That's not a problem at all. You guys, obviously you're finally firing, but in a bad spot. So what I want... These guys... Lure them there. Okay, so she's wasted the Sword of Cain. That's good. That is good. We finally had something go our way. Bring that to there because I want the Phoenixes to come in. Now you can fire it. Well, right. Look at how hard it is to kill those fucking things. So I need him to get that... No, 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 no. Stop killing our own bloody troops with friendly fire, you idiots.
Jess Ailes need to kill Alario, but she's got the Sword of Cain, so she's going to be phenomenally tanky. Oh, God, here we go. She's got the Sword of Cain. She's going to be fucking impossible to get rid of here. She's into us now, and we cannot fucking do anything about it. General. Kill that fucking dragon. I need to get him up to there because he is our only hope to get Alariel off of our troops for long enough that we can actually cut out the rest of her army like the fucking plague that it is. Jezels, kill that fucking phoenix now! Right, that's gone. battle markers once again getting in the way I think we've managed to rout her army the problem is her okay the army's gone the army is gone just keep shooting guys just do your thing we need to get those to here. Where is... Okay, so he's there. These guys can't retreat. It's inside a fucking settlement. God damn it. Okay. Okay, in that case... Can I get them off their artillery pieces? Yeah. All of you, come over here. Soon as there. There we go. Okay, I need her chasing them. Kill the bitch. And you cast a wither on her. Let's take her armor as well. And you overcast blessed with filth on them. Almost there. We've almost got her. Okay, we've got it. We've done it. We've got her. Oh my god, that was awful. Okay, we won. I don't think we even lost any units. Oh.
Okay, we're obviously returning the Sword of Cain. I'm getting sick of being offered it, to be honest, but it is what it is. Crace. Yeah, we, it's because we lost Torachar, that's fine. Well, I wouldn't describe it as fine, put it that way, but... What did we get there? It was a trait, wasn't it? Oh, he got wiped out anyway. But what does it do? It's He's not dead, but... Yeah. Master Engineer. We just want to get rid of these pricks. Go and get Shride of Loic just for the sake of it. This army, like I said, it's what, one turn left? Yeah, one turn left. And then we'll be able to bring them over again. I am not going to spend uh, any population surplus. Uh, do you know what? It doesn't matter. We've got so much growth that it doesn't matter. This army can get into Karond Kar. Yeah, we'll be basically replenished after one turn. We can't get to there. Can go here. Master Engineer! So go to there, ambush stance, let's see if we can catch anyone coming in. We are this army can then head towards Circle of Destruction. They will die by yeah, of doom. Yeah, I'm not waiting for the time. <laughs> Uh, besiege that when I can just auto it that easily. We reach Kawak. Nope, so we go into Underway Stance, jump to there. These ones, this army here is going to keep going on through until we get the Chaos Waste there. Our public order recovers so. And look at our money. We can afford so many armies now. But I just don't feel like I need any more than I'm having here. I want to recruit one more. In fact, I can do that at Kron, can't I? So let's do it now. Because I have two. This is the one that we already had, isn't it? Vermich, yeah. So we'll just get him. Because he's already got all of his stuff. Oh, no, 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 wait. We had we used him for something, didn't we? Yeah, okay. Whatever. It's basically the same thing. No, 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 no. Doomflare, Immortality, that's that. Looter, that. Let's see what other stuff we can get that. Oh, I'll accidentally put two into that. But you know what? I don't actually care enough to go back and redo that. Uh, we'll get rid of that. Uh, sorry, we'll get sneaky. I don't care about this stuff. Let's... Oh, okay. Yeah, whatever. A lot of luck stones. Let's get him that missile resistance, and for here...
engineer. So we want to get... Just so we can build up faster. Yeah, so it'll take us four turns. Warlock ready! Sorcerer, inventor, yes, yes! Jesus, how many of those luck stones have I got? And then we'll get some plaguey boys. Yes. Plague freak. Master Engineer, our pestilence comes. <sighs> you always have to scroll down for it as well. Okay, so that's ready to go. Let's have a look at our armies then and see who's moving away. So Queek has gone and caught himself some lizard things. Who dares challenge me, me? Consume them. He looks like he yeah, he's outside, so we'll get him. Time for things to die, die! Fools! Stop, stop, die, die! die. It's ready! Find trinkets for clan laws! Me for trophies, yes, yes! What, what? Capture that! Here. Okay, so I can summon a chieftain here. I want someone to go and have a look at these places to see have they really just left them unoccupied? Because that's weird. weak to betray. Yeah, so give him that order. Search the ruins. Because that would be very, very, very peculiar if they've done that. Trust him for now, now. Have a look at our other armies. <laughs> Knows I dominate. Um, whatever. Oh yeah, I forgot I've got him here as well. He can come over. I have to search a few of them because it doesn't really matter to us. We start building up blood swamps as well. We've got plenty of growth available. Oh, 
Okay, so there'll be the rebellion there. I just, yeah, why don't I just stop that? It's a waste of money. Just get rid of that. Settlement upgrade. We're not going to be spending money there, as I said. So let's see how we're getting on for time. Okay. So I'm going to call that an end to the episode. Um, I'll hit the end turn, and then if a battle starts... Um, we will make that the start of the next episode. Thank you very much for watching this, guys. I hope you're, again, enjoying it. And, yeah, leave a like, subscribe, you know, all the usual shit. Have a great one, guys. Cheers.